On Plus TV News Now. President Buhari justifies national honors on Okonja Wela, others. Soldier nabbed for stealing supplying ammunition to bandits. Governor Samuel Lu announces insurance scheme for Nollywood actors. Good evening. I am Maureen Menongwezigwe and this is the News Now. President Muhammadu Buhari on Tuesday in Abuja conferred national honors on 450 Nigerians and non-Nigerians, among them Director General of the World Trade Organization, Dr. Ngozi Okonjewela, Deputy Secretary General of UN, Amina Mohamed, and Nigeria's permanent representative to the UN, Professor Tijani Mohamed Bandi. Others who made the honors list include renowned novelist Chimamanda Adichie, Senate President Ahmed Lawan, Acting Chief Justice of Nigeria, Justice Olukayade Ariwola, Immediate Past CJN, Justice Ibrahim Tanko, Mohammed, among others. Buhari justified the honors, saying the awardees had distinguished themselves in the service of the nation and humanity. The national honors are not merely decorative. They remind us of an important part of our responsibility as students. We must always endeavor to do our best for our country. We will continue to root out all, as I stated earlier in my independent address to the nation. I will hand over a Nigeria, which is free from insecurity, to the next generation of leaders. I want to sufficiently commend the chairman and members of the National Honors and the Award Committee for a job well done. The list of our days is just probably long since this exercise has not been carried out since 2015. Your commitment to the process of screening and selection has been well guided. Let me attend to other Nigerians who are yet to receive this recognition to be patient and understand that their efforts in nation building are appreciated and at the right time will similarly be recognized. Excellencies, ladies and gentlemen, this administration will continue to partner with Nigerians and friends of Nigeria with like minds and to excel in their children's fields, deboard of parochial